I, I have to admit that in the beginning it feels really unusual and you're kind of prepared to take over at any moment. But it's also amazingly how quickly you get used to this and how quickly you start to become comfortable in this vehicle. When science fiction becomes reality, that's one way of describing the Sartre Road Train Research Project. It enables car drivers to let go of the steering wheel while still travelling safely along the highway. The actual driving is left to modern automated technology and to professional truck drivers. The road train should be led by a professional truck driver who is trained actually to lead a road train, so he's had a special training for this. He will then also be supported by state-of-the-art technology in the truck. It's quite fun to see uh, the passing vehicles. Uh, they're quite surprised uh, seeing me not driving the car but uh, reading a magazine. Road trains have two main benefits. They reduce environmental impact and traffic becomes much safer. The platoon is held together by wireless technology. It allows the vehicles following to travel the trail of the lead truck and to instantly react to any event. 90% of all accidents are due to human factors. However, computers can still only do what they're programmed to do. That's why Volvo trucks believe that the best way of using fully automated systems is by combining them with professional drivers' knowledge and expertise. This also means a whole new area of business for truck owners. Well, road trains will be important for the environment because we have an impact on uh, fuel consumption in road trains where we can uh, get a lower fuel consumption for all vehicles in, in the, the road train. And uh, then also uh, there's a benefit in it for the haulage company that uh, could get paid for being the lead vehicle. What the project has shown is that it is technologically possible to implement platoon traffic with multiple vehicles. Therefore, road trains could be a reality on the highways within five to ten years. What will take time, however, is to change social infrastructure, such as legislation and public acceptance. Initially, people might be anxious, but on the other hand, you don't think twice of getting on board of a plane or a bus. Being in a road train is exactly the same. You're being led by a professional driver. 